Hey guys, today we're going to be making another art project. So this art project project is especially perfect. It's perfect because Easter just ended a few days ago. And a few days ago, I posted an April Fool thing and which is right here. I posted how to make an April Fool hat. So I was, I was, wait, wait right here. I was making, I was making this April Fool's Queen hat. And it fits absolutely perfectly for me. So that is in one of my videos in my channel. If you haven't checked it yet, go check it. And it has two parts. Yeah. So first. Uh, if this project is perfect for Easter, so yeah. First we need white paper, plain paper. So and then we need a Sharpie or a marker or anything or even a pencil. And we are going to draw a bunny. So, but we are not going to draw the whole bunny, no. No, actually, we are drawing the whole bunny, actually. We are drawing the whole bunny. So, we are drawing the whole bunny. I just said something. So, first, we are going to draw the bunny's face. And by the way, guys, the Easter bunny actually came to our house. It came to our house. And then it gave me a lot of candy. I I don't even know how to finish that many candy. And my mom even gave me even more candy for Easter. I don't even know how to finish this much candy. I'm just going to draw an Easter bunny. So, um, what I'm doing is I'm, I just put like... A line like going like this and then one going here and then going like that and then I put a big U that is upside down and then I'm gonna do the same thing on this side so it looks like the bunny's head and then we're going to connect the bunny's face so yeah and then we are going to draw the bunny's body. And then it looks like this. And after that, we are going to draw the bunny's belly. So we're going to just put a U that is upside down. And then we're going to put the bunny's furry feet. Furry feet, that's alliteration. But anyways, we're putting its furry feet. And then we're putting the bunny's nails. One, two, three. So like that. Three dots. Then we're putting the bunny, the the Easter bunny, small little eyes. Actually, I'm going to make them a little big because I want my Easter bunny to be excited. So, I'm just putting an eye like this. So, follow that same step. You can even pause the video if you need extra time. So we are gonna do the same thing on thing on this side. And then we're drawing its eyelashes. Or if you want the Easter Bunny to be a boy, you could not add eyelashes. Or you could 
could even add eyelashes if you want. And it's cute little whiskers. And the Easter Bunny is cute little mouth. And then we also need to draw the Easter Bunny's little cute hand. Look at this. Now there, we've done our Easter Bunny. Now we need to color our Easter Bunny. It's super easy. First we need pink. Then we have to color its belly pink. Like that. And then its ears pink. And then we're going to color its nose pink. And there we go. So now we are going to cut the Easter Bunny out with our scissors. If you need extra time, you can pause the video. You could just follow along how I cut this. Or if you aren't allowed to cut, you could ask a parent. This Easter Bunny is so cute. He's just perfect. Just gonna cut it out. This pretty little Easter bunny. Gonna cut it out. And then cut this other side by starting from the head, then cutting the ears, there we go, getting prettier. And prettier. This Easter Bunny is my favorite one I ever grew. And I love it. But yeah, I just love it. So it looks so pretty. I love this Easter Bunny. And now I'm going to take my construction paper and then we're going to glue our Easter Bunny in the construction paper. So, we're going to take our glue or even we could use tape if we want. But glue is much easier, guys. Okay. Maybe not this one. Okay. I'll use the other glue that I have. Oh, this one. Okay. So, yeah, this would work. So, there, I got my glue. And then open it up. 
And then I'm going to stick the Easter Bunny in the construction paper by adding glue in the Easter Bunny. Then I'm going to stick it wherever we want. We can stick the Easter Bunny wherever we want. So I, but I am sticking the Easter Bunny here. Ooh, it looks so cute. And that's not it, guys. Now we are gonna add more detail. So, we're going to take more paper, or even, yeah. Yeah, we should take more paper. And then, we should take our Sharpies or marker or even, um, even, we could even use pencils or pens. We are just drawing a basket this way. So easy to draw a basket. First, we need to draw lines like this. And then you need to draw really thin cross lines. Right? And then as we go, we have to get freighter and crosser to the other side. So there. And we, we could even put more little lines to add more detail like that and then we're going to draw some eggs in the basket like overlapping because the easter bunny needs to give some eggs and some candy to to the kid or else it, it's not even something special in Easter. Candy is special in Easter. And so, and then I'm going to draw another egg overlapping here. And even more there like like that so now we have to color it so we're going to color the basket brown or yellow I'm coloring it yellow because I don't have brown I don't have dark light brown so and then we're just coloring the chocolate we could color the chocolates any way we want. I'm gonna color it amazing. Like, I'm gonna put some designs on the eggs and on the chocolate. I'm gonna color brown because chocolate is brown. Ooh, it looks great. And then we are putting some designs on the eggs. Ooh. Perfect. So now we are just, we're just putting some cool designs in the eggs.
putting some designs in. Designs. Lots of designs. this and then we should color this yellow and then color this even green if we want you could color it any way we, you want so I'm just coloring it up so it's perfect it's really perfect actually actually So now we are done drawing our Easter basket. Wait, are we forgetting something? The most important thing. A basket always needs an, a handle. How could we even forget that? Oh, I think we were so busy putting Easter eggs. Okay, so let me color the handle into... Yellow. Perfect. Now, we are going to cut it. There. We are going to cut it into like a, like, we're gonna color, I mean cut its, its shape, but we don't need to cut it that realistic. We just need to cut it normally, just a circle. That's enough. And then, to make it even, even more realistic after you cut it, You can rather like put put blue in here, or you could just cut that. Well, I'm gonna put blue in there because I want to make it even more realistic. The more realistic, the more better. Well, it's your choice if you want to do it or if you don't want to do it. It's your choice. So cool, it's very cool. It's showing like in, like behind it. And now we are going to stick it. Wherever you see white, you can color it into blue. And then it will look like you cut it Cutted it perfectly. So now we're gonna take this and then we're gonna put more blue bes behind it. More glue, even more glue. Perfect. Now let's stick it up. Stick. Check it up. Okay, now we got its Easter Easter thing. So now we're drawing we're gonna draw the other stuff. So like adding more detail. We're gonna draw just a sun on top. We're gonna draw a sun on top. It's so pretty. And then we're drawing like some lines in the sun because in the sun there's always lines. What is missing 
the lines. In the sun, there's always lines. What a funny song. Okay. So, and then we're taking some white. And then we're going to color the white in, in the blue paper into like a cloud. Because clouds are always white. Do you think so? Give a thumbs up if you think so. And also like and share. And subscribe, of course. How could I ever forget that? And how could you ever forget that? You shouldn't forget to subscribe. But if you did, that's okay. You can just go and click that subscribe button. If you haven't yet. So now I am just done doing these and I am done the whole craft. So that's the end of doing our craft and it's so beautiful. And if we want you can, if you want you can even write like happy Easter in it. And then an exclamation mark. And done. That's the end of this video, guys. Hope you liked it. And hope you're fo you followed it along. Thanks for watching. And see you next time on my channel. Bye.